when you have lived on this planet for over 80 years, chances are that you have loved and lost, you've laughed and cried, you've been hurt and you've been kind, you've done some great things and some you regret, you've seen babies being born and others pass away. That my friend is wisdom. So when our children sit in front of these elderly and ask them, could you give us advice? What then follows is powerful. It is unlike what you and I could say. We teach heroism and heroism to us is the decision to be in service of others through humility, honesty, and kindness. We asked our children to look around the community and think about the various forms of inequality. And they said to us that they wanted to do something small but meaningful. So we decided to visit our local care home, the Manor Farm Care Home, um, and spend some time with the elderly residents there who may be spending their twilight years confined to a room you know, or to a building with not many to talk to. They said they wanted to make them feel that there are some who care and wanted to make them feel loved. They met the residents uh, between the ages of 80 and 96 uh, and had long conversations with them, hearing about their past lives. You know, this is something that cannot be amassed from books or the internet or educational apps or even in schools. These are experiences we give to our children that require us to go out and think broader and think bigger and think heroically. And this is what we're all about. And we urge all schools across the UK who want to give such experiences to their children to get in touch with us. Because together I truly believe that we can inspire the next generation of our children to think broadly, act heroically and make a tangible difference in the lives of others.